Hello, I'm Lisa Fox, known as Scare the Fox, or mostly on Twitch, Space Fox Lisa. Excuse if my mic is a bit picking up other sounds, but I'll try to at least get the audio clean if needed. Um, so let's begin. If you're wondering, there is no music because I'm not trusting the fear of DMCA. <laughs> So some of my content isn't exactly scary, but I've been still chicken to play some horror games. Maybe one day that I'll I'll try and be a bit brave. <laughs> As you can hear, I'm also stuttering because I'm <laughs> I'm kind of winging this, so I'll do my best to talk here. Um, I'm still kind of small, but I have a big heart. <laughs> And can you relate to that? <laughs> uh, so let me uh, just go ahead and if if uh, you don't have to show likes or anything like that, I just wanted to show good support for once in my life that I did something to try to help when watching Mama Max one of my one of Mama Max's videos pick a side. And um, I'm sure my other fellow YouTubers that I know who are small like me would do the same. <laughs> Even if they don't, I know they show support or I'll give them a fun loving nudge on the head. <laughs> and uh, do the galaxy dance on them. Okay, and <laughs> enough joking though. Um, so... <laughs> Not many know I am or who I am or what I like what I did in the past. Um, I used to do artwork for a past creator back then in YouTube's golden era with um, I'm pretty sure if you guys heard of uh, which was uh, sanity not included. I remember Dex uh, wanted to or wanted me uh, to make a skit about next and other fun little tiny you know creative project things I didn't think about making a comic for them I just wanted to draw for them and didn't think I'd get picked it was like a contest so pretty much <laughs> get picked and um, you know that's when I start drawing for them but when I did get picked it it, it happened so I won't uh, go far about what else that happened. So that's okay. This is about Mama Max and his video. Also about YouTube picking its side. For a while I've been watching Mama Max in silence. I usually don't make a lot of content. Some of my content isn't, you know, that great. At least when I stream it on Twitch, I just did whatever I could. The last time I had fun making interesting YouTube videos was about Super Smash Brothers Brawl. And it, they, it was random, just random people on Super Smash Brothers. And they were having fun, and I was having fun. And obviously, I was the Marth person. <laughs> it's not about that. But, uh, so let me get back to the subject again on Mama Max here. I'm, <laughs> okay. So, hey, I'm, I'm just a humanoid box on a YouTube platform that hasn't shined its peak and you know I'm, I'm okay with that however I do not know that if you've seen Mama Max's video hashtag pick a side YouTube to some people they think it's too far to some I believe it's super above and beyond more encouraging than you know it's, it's just really a good strong message too and <laughs> it's just, you know, very encouraging, at least I think it is. It's nice to see he still cares even in his own uh, creative, you know, just seeing him in his own creative style. And it's just like art is in many forms in the, you know, in his videos. So I really like how his videos are to me when he's trying to get a message out there too, you know, to stop, you know, people being 
abusive to like child predator and and abusive stuff just not good so i myself have had a dark side when i go through depression myself and i saw one of mama max's video his classic video uh called ugly and his video made me smile then i began to watch more and more of his video then i i just wanted to join his discord server to be connected with mama max haven't had the courage to click and find but i wanted to tell him thank you for lighting that fire in my heart i may be a silent artist a baby comedian sometimes a singer uh, a person that can give support when or when i meet people when they need comfort or help or they just want to hear me talk <laughs> so yeah however you know i fell head over heels with mama max's words he also encouraged someone like me to keep living that's how uh, impactful he was to me back then maybe one well i guess i have to say mama max one day in your discord i can truly tell you how i felt in those times for now i just I just wanted to say this. <laughs> when I understood also about, you know, Mama Max's new video of that pick aside, I believe what he was, when, when I understood what Mama Max was telling someone like everyone out there to do something to help others reach out to other YouTubers, make a difference for the future, nothing wrong with doing that. I think it would be nice if YouTube did hire a good team, even check if they can, you know, legit care about the content, the content that, and not just take it down without knowing what's going on. Seeing Mama Max's video taken down, which I was lucky to see it before it was taken down about IMVU. I remember I was in IMVU myself seeing how random adults sometimes on on there want to hook up and just possibly do bad things and i was a young kid back then thinking it was creepy anyways however i hope at the end of this video that mama max video would be heard loud and clear now some youtubers may not find his content great but to me it did reach out to you know to the ears and the heart about how badly he wants to help others also i'm trying to make a you know also i'm trying to make a difference too for me even if this video is probably the only legit video without it being cut too much or if i bother to edit cut the video at all and me scrolling through mama max's pick a side youtube also showing other youtubers content that is doing their thing on here too which looks really awesome like everybody has their own talent on here for sure but just know i just want to say mama max i hope the entire company of youtube truly take their time to not brush this under the rug sorry it's a short video and i could draw or i, I would have draw or something and i figured just just talk <laughs> guys remember to to hashtag pick a side youtube um, and also no one deserves to be touched wrong or abused or hurt or anything of the meaning of unquote evil behind it until then later and sorry i don't have a catchy ending line yet but <laughs> i'm sure one day i will all right see you guys later